morning, YouTube family. Um, it is Friday. It is officially the start of week eight countdown for me. I don't feel so hot today. I said over my weight to Angela, I'm up two pounds and I feel kind of poopy. Um, definitely my digestive system. The only thing I can think um, is that I had premier protein drinks the last couple days. So I'm not sure if they're not sitting well with me, but I'm not going to have them anymore um, because that yeah, I don't feel great. My tummy does not feel great. My tummy actually kind of hurts. It feels kind of hard. I feel kind of bloated. Um, so, yes, the joys of prep. I probably also need to increase my fiber, so I'm going to start paying a little closer attention to my fiber intake. Um, and then I've just been really tired. The last couple of nights, I've fallen asleep really early. Uh, for me, really early is like 2, 2.30, and I can't keep my eyes open anymore. I'm just done. I literally struggling to keep my eyes open, and so I make my way to bed. And I have slept really hard. Sometimes I have a really hard time. So I have to wake up in the morning, even though I fall asleep late, like 2, 2.30 or later sometimes. I have to take my kids to school in the morning uh, at 6.30, 7 o'clock. So I usually come home and sometimes have a hard time falling asleep for like an hour, hour and a half afterwards, which is a sucky thing. But then I get back to sleep. I sleep till about 2, 2.30. So anyways, um, the last couple of nights, I have had no issues going to sleep after I get home at all. I am exhausted. I'm exhausted at night. I'm exhausted in the morning. And I think it's just prep. I'm getting kind of low and we're getting further into the weeks. So it's fun. And I had a really hard workout last night. Um, it felt like a struggle, but I pushed some good numbers. I keep seeming to push good numbers even when it feels like a struggle. So I'll take it, but it just, uh, it's, it's hard. So anyways, um, it is time to check my blood sugar. I sent over my weight already to Angela. Um, I'm going to send off my pictures after I do my fasted cardio. I'm just, I just don't feel good. And I'm hoping that fasted cardio will help my tummy just kind of feel a little better. Maybe, I don't know. So anyways, otherwise I feel like prep is going well. Last couple of days have been poopy with my tummy, but I have one more night off and then I have a couple more nights of work. Ah, there we go. I wasn't getting enough of a spot. Seventy-eight. So it's a little lower side, but calories are lower. Anyways, um, yeah. So seventy-eight. I have a feeling Angela will change something today. So I don't have a workout today. It's my rest day. Um, and I'll just I'll show you my foods today, and then I'll do my yoga. You can hang out with me when I do my yoga. I'll take you along with that and my stretching. I am just going to take my fasta supplements. Um, I'm out of one of them, the Yohimbine extract. I have a new bottle coming in. Um, I believe it'll be here tomorrow. So I ordered the one I was off of Amazon and it's similar, but not the same thing. So I'll probably take a little bit of that just so I'm not, not taking something for a couple of days. And then my L-carnitine. Um, let's hop on the bike, get this day rolling. Anyways. All right, no talking. Time to go on the bike. Peace. So I have not heard back from Coach yet. Um, yeah, I'm just sitting on pins and needles over here waiting to see what she's going to do with my cardio or my macros or whatever. Um, so in the meantime, I put on some cute clothes since we have a beautiful sunny day and I don't hardly ever get a chance to wear non-gym clothes. Uh, I just figured I'd put on some cute clothes today, make myself look pretty and feel better since my tummy was feeling so poopy. It is feeling a little bit better. Um, 
not much, but a little bit. And I messaged her about that too. So we'll she, see what she says. And like I said, I'm going to lay off the Premier Protein and see what helps with that. Hopefully that'll help. I'm going to try to get some more greens and fiber today as well. Hopefully that'll help clear up whatever's going on. Um, otherwise, I am starving. We have the mother-in-law with us. Um, picked up the kids from school already. Uh, stopped by the business. So now it's time to go home and get some breakfast. So let me show you that. And then I'll let you know what I know when I know it from the boss. I'm ready to push a little harder. My energy is really low, but I got more push in me. I got this. So, and then we might go bowling with the kids later. It's Friday night and I have the night off. So I'm um, thinking about making some pizza, cauliflower crust pizza. I might do for myself. I don't know what we're gonna do yet, but it's Friday. I wanna have a little bit of fun. So anyways, hang in there. I'll update you when I get an update. Peace. I just heard back from coach. She agrees to stop the premier protein. I guess her hubby got a flat from Costco and they gave him all sorts of digestive issues. So I have a whole bunch of premier protein that I just got from Costco if anybody wants it. I have my breakfast, same thing I pretty much always eat except for I did add in a little avocado today. If you can see that. We'll see how this goes with this food and how it makes me feel better. Hopefully, yesterday it helped. Um, no workout today, so just rest and take it easy and hopefully it all goes well, but no changes. So that's exciting. She says my photos look great. <laughs> Whatever. I'll take it. I'm just going to keep on trucking. All right. See you guys in a bit. Hey there, YouTube fam. So decided to do something fun for the kids for dinner and we're going to make pizza. So he is making pizza dough already rising. Looks really pretty. I don't know if you can see that through the cellophane, but, um, and then I am going to make a cauliflower crust pizza dough for myself. Um, and then I stopped at Walmart really quickly and I got some sauce just for myself, just cause we're going to make sauce for everybody, but I really didn't feel like doing all the calculations tonight for myself. So I got, oh, where is it? Here we go. So I found this sauce at Walmart. Um, not my favorite store to go to, but it's called Scarpetta Marinara Pasta Sauce, but it has nine grams of carbs, two grams of protein, and only one gram of fat. So I figured I would try that out, see how it tastes. Um, and then I got some little tomatoes. I also got some uh, reduced fat turkey pepperoni, and then I have my ground turkey, the fat-free ground turkey. I'm gonna go ahead and use that with the turkey pepperoni. Um, make my own little pizza with some veggies. So we're gonna, put, I'm gonna put lots of veggies on it. I got some basil, got the tomatoes as you saw. Um, we also have um, some roasted uh, mini butt peppers that we did last night, plus some fresh ones, um, some onion, all that good stuff. I'll probably put some spinach on it. Just make it really, really loaded with veggies, uh, lots of fiber, and then I'm gonna use my fat-free cheese. So, should be tasty. Let's see how it goes. I've never made this cauliflower crust before, so it's going to be an experiment for me and Danny. We'll see how we like it. So, ah, uh, should be exciting. So it has Italian herbs and garlic and salt and fat-free cheese, and it smells good. It smells like a little cauliflower-y, but we'll see. Gonna go in the oven. Let's we'll see how this goes. Here it goes. We'll see how it works. We couldn't see your thumb. What? He doesn't like to be on my YouTube. Nope. You're cute. He's gonna be Insta famous even if he doesn't want to be, just because he's good looking. Nope. He'll be in my video, huh? Nope. Yeah, you have to record me at my show. Huh? All I'm the good boyfriends show, record. But... 
All they, all of them do, and they talk and everything too. Yeah, but yeah, but yeah, but he thinks he's not photogenic, guys. Nope. He's nope. he's mistaken. He's confused. Nope. Anyways, he's a good chef and also dirty dishes. Sorry about my dirty dishes. Okie okay, dokie. Okay, so my cauliflower pizza crust is in the oven. I am starving though. I haven't had anything since breakfast, so I'm going to have this little chocolate dough bear bells bar oh hold it upside down might help you to be able to read it and i found these at trader joe's they also have them at a gas station uh, right near my house so i got some there today trader joe's has one that's called salty nut they didn't have it at the gas station and that was really good so i'll probably go back and get a couple of those but i got a few of these so i'm gonna have one of these real quick pizza crust should be done shortly and then oh for the pizza crust toppings i have these turkey pepperoni and then I got Canadian bacon as well. Um, the Canadian bacon only has one and a half grams of fat for five slices. So we might do like half pepperoni, half bacon, or kind of split it up, maybe with some fat-free ground turkey. And the pepperoni turkey has four grams of fat per serving, but it's 12 slices. So that's a pretty good amount of slices. So it says there's four, con four servings in this whole container. So we'll see how it plays out on the pizza. But we'll probably do a little combination of those two and then the ground turkey and like I said, lots of veggies. So I'll show you the crust when I pull it out of the oven. It smells really good. So we're gonna put some toppings on this instead of again. See how it looks then. Put it back in the oven till it melts. I'm gonna use this Italian marinara that um, I found at Walmart. It has really good macros. It only had one gram of fat, nine grams of carbs, and two grams of protein per serving. If you can see that, that was Walmart. I don't love that store, but every once in a while I get something okay there. fam we are in the car had to uh, go close up the business and put a pause on the pizza making ours is done um, we're gonna reheat it when we get home uh, mom-in-law stayed a little bit longer than we expected she's actually gonna spend the night tonight so I haven't had a chance to do my yoga yet so once we get home I'm gonna put our pizza in the oven just for a few minutes to reheat it I'm gonna do some yoga real quick and then we're gonna scarf down some pizza I haven't put the macros in yet. I'm going to do that on my way home since the baby is driving. So anyways, hang in there. We're going to have some pizza soon.
we finished up at the laundromat. Uh, you just saw I just did some yoga. Uh, I did a little 20 minute flow and then I just did a little extra stretching on my wheel afterwards and a little extra stretching on my hips. Um, pizza's warming up in the oven like I said. So I'm going to have a quick snack. The kids are playing a board game with Danny. I'm going to join them here in a minute because it's Friday night and it's family night. We're having fun. So anyways, while the pizza's warming up, I'm going to have this snack. You see that? It is by Twin Peaks Ingredients. It's protein puffs, nacho cheese. It's 21 grams of protein um, per one cup serving. So this is a third cup. So it has seven grams of protein, one gram of carb, one gram of fat. Um, I'm gonna have this. My pizza is pretty protein heavy, but it's pretty carby too. Not a lot of fat. So I'm probably gonna have some avocado with my pizza, but I'm gonna try these real quick. These are good. I like these. So I'm gonna hang out, play some board games, um, probably play some video games later. But I'm just gonna enjoy my last night off. I'll show you my pizza as soon as I pull it out of the oven. It looks really, really good. So, just finished pulling this out of the oven. It's completely done. We reheated it a little bit. Um, I get to have a quarter of this pizza as my dinner. I'm gonna cut it up. We'll see how it looks all cut up. Yummy! So, it came out like a total fail. It tastes good, but like, it's completely adhered. Like the crust, the cauliflower crust that I made is like half of it stuck on the tin foil so i'm gonna eat it it still tastes good but i'm gonna lose some of the macros obviously i'm just gonna end up eating with a fork no anyways still tastes good so like i showed you it's completely adhered Oh my gosh. So, no. It tastes really good though. I mean, it's pizza E. It's good. It just sucks. I'm gonna definitely lose some of the macros on it. Right. They don't all come out. But, it's a pretty pizza. It'd be prettier if it would come off and you could eat it and like pick it up and have a slice. So, uh, I'm gonna eat this. Yummy. And uh, for my little bit of dessert, I'm gonna have this Halo Top uh, ice cream, peanut butter with a little bit of smooth, creamy peanut butter. I melted and drizzled on top. Um, and then before bed, later, I do also have a little bit of cream of rice planned. I'll show you that. I'm gonna do that with a little bit of uh, protein powder. So, but I decided my tummy was feeling better. I wanted to have a sweet treat. I'm really having a craving. So, I'm gonna have this. So the kids have all gone to bed. Danny's making himself a drink. I am just trying to get through this area of the video game that we're playing. It's fun, very challenging, but fun. This little area is hard. This thing is gnarly. It kills you with one hit, and then you have to get dealt with these little alcoves and hide from it. And then there's bad guys in some of the alcoves, and they'll try to kick you out into it. Watch this jerk right up here on my left. They'll try to knock me out into it. And I'm not gonna let him. Things gonna come back up. But anyways, um, my pizza was so tasty that I made earlier, and then the ice cream totally hit the spot. Ah, oh, it's gonna hit me as I hit him too. Anyways, we're just gonna keep hanging out, playing some video games, take turns, you know, have some fun, enjoy our Friday night. I'll go to bed in a little bit. Mom-in-law is still here hanging out with us. Actually, she's asleep, so not hanging out too much. Anyways, I'll show you my bedtime snack in a little bit, but this Friday is going well. 
All right, so this is my bedtime snack, a little cream of rice with some corn nutritional red velvet cake protein powder mixed in. I'm gonna down this, and then I do have work for a couple nights, and we'll check in on Tuesday, and we'll see how things go over the weekend. All so right. it's Tuesday, guys. Uh, it's almost 4.30. Um, I worked last night. I've been really, really, really tired. Yesterday was the hardest cardio session I've ever had, um, for sure. I just have no energy at all. Um, I just want to sleep. I want to lay around. I just want to be lazy. Um, my legs feel like they're 100 pounds each. It takes everything to just to do anything right now. This last week just hit me really, really hard, like a ton of bricks. Um, anyways, so despite all of that, I sent my check-in over to Angela this morning, and I did tell her I was up for a push um, because... I really, really, really want to just look the absolute best I can on stage. So I want her to push me as hard as she needs to push me. And uh, she said she wanted to see my measurements and photos first. So I just sent those over. Um, my weight actually was a new low this morning, not drastically. I'm 122.1 pounds. Um, my lowest so far has been 122.5. So almost half a pound. So that's not bad for me. I just was surprised by it. So um, not drastically different from the measurements. So she might push me and she might not just because the scale dropped a half a pound. We'll see. Um, I'm excited to see what she's going to do either way. Good morning. Good morning. It's not helping. What is it? Oh. smashing my face. All right, sorry about some technical errors I was having with my poker and then my phone and it's all just, it's prep. Ugh. It's been a challenge. I'm hanging in there. Musa. There we go. So it's reading 85, which is good. In range. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and take my Yohimbine. I have my L-carnitine already mixed up right here. And my really cool shaker bottle from Fit Club. If you've never been to Vegas or been to Fit Club, if you like working out and you're a bodybuilder, which I'm assuming you have some interest in bodybuilding if you're watching my video, um, Fit Club in Vegas is the coolest gym I've ever been to. I would have a gym like that someday of my own. That's my plan or something kind of like that. Um, but anyways, that's my cool shaker bottle. And then I'm going to take my Yohimbine. I'm going to go take a shower and get some breakfast in me. And then we're going to go to the gym. I'm going to take you on my upper body day. Uh, I think I've taken you to a couple leg days, a glute day, whatnot, but we haven't hit an upper body day yet. So we'll get our upper body day in, get some shoulders pumped, work my back a little bit. I love working my back. I used to work it so much and I can't work it nearly as much as coach says my upper body is already jacked enough. So anyways, let's get this day rolling. Peace. All right, so my breakfast, here we go. Coffee looks a little funky. I don't know if you saw it when I poured it out. Um, it like did a weird separation thing, but it's good. Tastes good, smells good, looks good. Expiration dates fine. Egg beaters, salsa, spinach, mushrooms, toast, laughing cow, yogurt, all the good stuff, everything I normally have. Can't wait to eat this down and go to the gym. Oh my God. So I just got the best news for Angela. I'm like freaking super, super stoked. Totally did not expect it at all. I thought we were gonna push harder and maybe this is pushing harder i don't know but she's giving me more food for two days 200 grams of carbs i'm so excited i can't wait to have more food uh, i have a glute day tomorrow so i'm super pumped to carb load beforehand and crush it and then have carbs afterwards yay i'm so freaking stoked so now i'm like super hyped up to go and crush this workout tonight so we're gonna stop by the laundromat it's gonna run in there real fast and head to the gym we'll see you in a few peace
YouTube fam. Got home from the laundromat a few minutes ago and the gym, closed everything up. Had a pretty solid workout and then just dumped hard while I was helping close up the laundromat. Um, we did have a little Bear Bells bar in the car that we shared after the gym. So I try to have something after the gym. And then I did have my carb powder in my water, but I still felt really poopy. So this is my little snack a Rooney after. Um, it's a wrap with a little laughing cow cheese and some spicy mustard and a little bit of light mayonnaise and some lettuce. So I'm gonna have this and then I'm gonna practice my posing. I'm gonna have dinner. Just chill out for the night. I'll show you my food, but we're not doing much tonight. I'm just going to hang out. It's my night off, so nothing exciting, but I get more carbs tomorrow, so that's exciting. Yay. I really hope it's going to give me a killer workout, but we'll see. I'm excited either way. So, see you in a bit. Okay, guys, so I'm going to sign off for the night here. Um... Would be signing off for the week as well, but I'm gonna take you to the gym with me tomorrow since I have my high carb day and I'm super excited about how that's gonna go, eating extra food along with my workout. Maybe I'll just feel amazing, I don't know. I'm super excited though. So for tonight, I'm gonna finish off with my cream of rice. I put some red velvet corn nutritionals protein powder in there and then I put some Walden's farm syrup in there and I made it too thin, so I won't be doing that again. Anyways, and I put some creamy peanut butter on top. So super, super, super yummy like this. First time I've done the syrup, so oh well, it's too thin. Um, anyways, and I'm gonna see you tomorrow. We're super excited. Peace. So it is Wednesday um, morning for me. It's one o'clock, almost 1.30. Um, so I have to work tonight and tomorrow. My plan is to show you my food today um, I'm going to kind of carb load around my workout, which I will do on the way to work. It's a glute workout. So I'm going to take you along with that. And I'm going to show you what I eat tonight. And then I check in on Friday with Angela. We're just going to see how this carb loading goes and we're going to finish out week eight strong. So I'm super excited. Um, I've had a bit of an emotional morning, so just getting really excited for my show and prep has me a little bit emotional right now. So anyways. I am taking my fastest supplements. I have my L-carnitine right here. I already took my Yohim bean. So, yeah, I'm just, I kind of want to get my cardio done. So, I'm going to do my cardio, practice some posing. I'm just excited for prep. Maybe this isn't a normal response, but it is what it is. It's my response. So, I will see you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, so this is my first meal of the day. I am adding some sweet potatoes since I get to have extra carbs today, along with my regular breakfast. It looks so good. All right guys, I am now on my way to work. I'm running late, big shock, oh my God. Yeah, right, it's so me, freaking horrible. I thought I had all this time and I was planned out my time and I thought I was doing everything well for the day and all of a sudden my time was gone. So I was having to get my daughter to help me. Anyways, the extra sweet potato was so good on my breakfast, um, but I am feeling a little fuller, so I'm hoping I'll be able to use that pretty well at the gym, use that little extra fuel for energy. And then I did, I did add a little extra sweet potato to my other meals, I'll show you those later. And then I added an extra, not an extra, but I added a little rice cake, so I'm excited to have that. Otherwise, pretty much the same old, same old. Let's go to the gym and get this booty pop on. I'll see you in a minute. So that was a super fast, short workout. Um, I obviously did not get enough in, um, but I have glutes and hamstrings on Saturday. 
And I'm off on Saturday, so I plan on just hitting my glutes a little extra hard on Saturday. I'll probably do a little extra. Um, try to make up for today, basically, I guess you could say. Um, anyways, I still felt like it was good. I felt like I wasn't pushing hard, and then when I look at my numbers, again, um, it looked like I was pushing harder than I thought I was. So, that was good. Um, I am just going to run into work now, and I will check in with you on my next meal break when I get there and get kind of tucked in. I will have my post-workout meal, even though I didn't work out super hard. Anyways, I'll see you in a few. Hey, what's up, YouTube? Just checking in on my first break. Um, I didn't get to eat right, right away when I got to work. I had to tuck my patient in for a little bit. So it is now eight o'clock just after. Um, so I'm eating my first meal here at work. If you can see. Ah, and a piece of potato is down. Let me show you better. It's lean ground turkey with buffalo sauce and rice, cauliflower rice, and that is with some sweet potato and some iceberg lettuce. So I'm gonna eat my extra carbs and then I'm gonna go back and check on my patient. I'll go back to work. I'll check in with you on my next break. Peace. So thank God I decided to eat when I did because this is what happens at my job all the time. Let me show you. Hey guys, I'm just trudging along at work, so I'm gonna have my rice cake and my energy drink and keep working on my water. See you at my next break. Okay guys, another meal. Chicken rotisserie breast with a carb balanced tortilla with flax seeds, butter lettuce, spicy mustard, light mayo, laughing cow cheese, light one, my coffee, bean juice with some sugar-free Starbucks caramel macchiato and a Splenda. And I'm working on another of my waters. I will see you on my next break. Time for another snack. This is my Dan and Light and Fit yogurt with blueberries and my cookies and cream Bear Bells bar. I love these protein bars. It's like a freaking candy bar. So this will be a yummy little sweet snack. And then I have a couple more meals left. All right, guys, getting tired, but this is one of my last meals for the night. This is a little sweet potato, some more rice and cauliflower rice ground turkey, 99% fat free, a little bit of sugar free barbecue sauce, and then I'll have some cream of rice later, I'll show you that. Almost done for the night. Last meal of the night, a little bit of cream of rice, and that on top is a nut butter that I bought, it's a combo nut butter, and then I mixed it with some PB Fit chocolate. Should be tasty, drink a little bit more of my water, but my gallon plus is done. I'll see you in a few minutes. I'll sign off. Hey guys, I'm on my way home. I am beater than beat right now. I am absolutely exhausted. Um, but that was a full night of meat eating with extra carbs and a very, very, very partial glute workout, which I will have to make up for this weekend. Friday. I know I said Saturday earlier, but it's Friday. And then I have my check-in on Friday. So if you don't, please subscribe. Um, otherwise, we'll be starting week seven here in just a couple days. I'm super excited. Really glad to be sharing this journey with all of you guys. It's hard right now, but it will be so worth it in the end. So, anyways, I couldn't finish my cream of rice at work. I had to get in the car, so I'm just going to eat that in the car while I drive home. I'm going to probably barely climb in bed and pass the heck out. So, I will see you guys next week. Peace.